Hi kids! Isang matatag na araw. I'm Sir Noy and welcome to Mat Bilang. In this video, you will learn how to compare numbers up to 1 million using equal sign, less than sign, and greater than sign. Also, you will learn how to arrange numbers up to 1 million in increasing and decreasing order. Let's have this word problem. Tom has 2,345 marbles and Sarah has 3,672 marbles. Who has more marbles? Let's review about place value. Ones, tens, hundreds, thousands, ten thousands, hundred thousands, and millions. And let's have these signs. This sign is a greater than sign. This sign is used when the first number is greater than the second number. This sign is a less than sign. This sign is used when the second number is lesser than the first number. And equal sign. This sign is used when the two numbers are the same. And in comparing numbers, Compare the digit starting from the highest place value to the least. The larger the digit, the greater is the number. Let's now compare numbers up to 1 million using these compare signs. Let's compare the marbles of Tom and Sarah. Tom has 2,345 while Sarah has 3,672 marbles. To compare these two numbers, let's count the number of digits in a number. So this first number has 1, 2, 3, 4, 4 digits. While this number has 1, 2, 3, 4, also 4 digits. If they have the same number of digits, compare the numbers using the highest place value. Let's now compare the digits in the highest place value. So we have 2 and 3. Since 3 is greater than 2, that means 2,345 is less than 3,672. Let's have another set of numbers. Compare the two given numbers. Let's count the number of digits in a number. So the first number has 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. 5 digits. And the other number has 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. They have the same number of digits. So, let's compare the digits in the highest place value. 7 and 7. If the digits are the same, move to the next place value. Which is 8 and 7. Since 8 is greater than 7, that means 78,542 is greater than 77,342. Another set of numbers. Let's compare them. Let's count the number of digits in a number. So the first number has 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. 5 digits. And the second number has 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. 6 digits. That means this is the greater 1. So 99,999 is less than 601,241. Another set of numbers. Let's compare them. As you can see, they have the same number of digits. And the digits are all the same. That means we will use the equal sign. So, 327,815 is equal to 327,815. Another one. Since they have the same number of digits, and the four first digits are the same, move on to the next place value, 3 and 8. And since 8 is greater than 3, that means 421,038 is less than 421,086. Let's try! Compare the two given numbers. 
Very good! 53,427 is greater than 90,932 because 5 is greater than 1. Another one. They have the same number of digits but 2 is greater than 1. That means 165,890 is less than 231,801. Another one is greater than. Very good! Since the four first digits of the number are the same, we compared 3 and 1. And 3 is greater than 1. So that means the first number is greater than the second number. How about these numbers? Yes, they are the same. So, they are equal. Let's now arrange the numbers up to 1 million in increasing and decreasing order. Increasing order. It means arranging numbers from the smallest to the largest. Let's have this set of numbers. Let's arrange these numbers in increasing order or smallest to largest. Let's compare them all. They have the same number of digits. Six digits each number. So, we will compare the first digits in the highest place value of each number. Seven, nine, six, and eight. Let's choose the least number. Six is the smallest number. So, we will put this number in number one. Let's cross out this number. We have three remaining numbers, and seven is the smallest one. So, this number is number two. Let's now compare the two last numbers, 9 and 8. And 8 is lesser than 9, so this number is number 3. And the last number is 910,302. It's the greatest one. So these are the numbers in increasing order, or smallest to largest. Let's have another set of numbers. Let's arrange them in increasing order. Let's count all the digits in a number. Since this number has only 5 digits, that means this is our number 1. Let's compare the 3 remaining numbers. Since they have all 6 digits number, let's compare the highest place value digits. We have 1, 7, and 2. Since 1 is the least one, that means this is number 2. And 2 is lesser than 7, that means this is number 3. And 7 is the largest one. So these numbers are arranged in increasing order. Let's compare another set of numbers. They have the same number of digits. And all of the highest place value digits are all 5. So let's move on to the next place value. 3, 7, 7, and 3. Two digits are 3 and the other two digits are 7. Since 3 is lesser than 7, let's compare first the two numbers which has 3 digits. These two numbers. Since they have the same digits 5 and 3, let's move on to the next place value. 1 and 0. Since 0 is lesser than 1, so this number is our 1. And the next number is 2. Let's now compare the two remaining numbers. So 7 and 7 are the same. We will move on to the next place value. 1 and 0. And 0 is lesser than 1. That means this number is number 3. And the last number is number 4. Decreasing order. Arranging numbers from largest to smallest. Let's try these numbers. We are going to find the largest number. Since they have the same number of digits, let's compare the highest place value digit. 7, 9, 6, and 8. Since 9 is the largest one, this is our number 1. And 8 is the second. 7 and 6. 6 is the smallest one. Another set of numbers. Since the three numbers have six digit numbers, so 7 is our first number. Next is 2. The third one is 1. 
and the last number or the smallest number is 99,999 since it has only 5 digits in a number. Activity time! Activity number 1. Write greater than is less than or equal sign between the pairs of numbers. Let's check your work! Activity number 2 Arrange the following set of numbers in increasing order or smallest to largest. So these are the answers. Activity number 3. Arrange the following set of numbers in decreasing order or largest to smallest. And these are the answers. Always remember, when comparing numbers, start with the highest place value and move digit by digit from left to right to determine which is a greater or smaller. Use correct symbols and remember that the length of the number can also indicate its size. Thank you so much for watching. Please subscribe to my channel and like my Facebook page. Happy learning!